Hi everybody, this is Black Sheep Girl and I'm just walking to go get some breakfast. I just wanted to talk to you about something that's repeated in the Bible. I don't know how many times, but I know it's there. It says that we shouldn't be deceived. And that's not the only thing. Uh, the Lord says not to be afraid. And, you know, it says in the Bible, if, if they say he's in a field or wherever, don't believe them. Uh, I just want to tell you that the word says, do not be deceived. Hi, everybody. I just came out of the restaurant, got my food. Now I'm going to go catch the bus. And I'm going to attempt to put together a sort of ragtag, I suppose you could call it, bathing suit. Modest bathing suit. I'm going to find a regular bathing suit. And then I have swim capris that are made for modest bathing suits. My swim dress ripped. So, I'm on my way to the bus stop to get myself a regular one-piece bathing suit. And I'll just wear two t-shirts over it and then I'll wear the bathing suit under that of course and then I'll wear the capris over the bottom of my bathing suit that way there will still be some sense of modesty until I get a bathing suit that's a real modest one I just wanted to remind you that you know there's traps everywhere for Christians just like there's bear traps everywhere the devil's trying to set traps through people and other devices. So, I just wanted to remind you so that you would keep your eye on the Lord, you know. So, it's so easy to get caught up in things and get deceived. You don't want to do that. Just like people could say, he's here or there. They could also say, he's coming this time, he's coming at that time. But the word says, We don't know the day or the hour. Only the Father does, right? I think that the rain is mostly gone, but I'm not sure. I just wanted to tell you, to keep hanging on. Don't give up. I know it can be hard. Sometimes I feel like I want the Lord to come now. I want Him to come right now. But then other times I'm like, yeah, but more people need to know about the Lord, you know, and my family and stuff, you know, and other people I care about as well. Anyway, it's hard walking around and my lungs feel so, uh, I just feel so out of breath. I hope when I start swimming again, it'll help me. I gotta swim at least once a week. It's just that I've been waiting for this swimsuit to come in and it hasn't. I guess I'm gonna end this for now because I'm almost at the bus stop. I was just gonna ask you to pray for me because I have, I, right now I currently have, until the Lord heals me, I have this lung disease, it's called interstitial lung disease and uh, I haven't been swimming and it's really affecting me like it used to. So. Read the Word of God. And don't be deceived. Just keep calling on God and asking Him to help you. It's like hunters, they set out bear traps. And if you're not careful, you could get caught in it. It's meant for a bear, but you could get caught in it. Well, the devil's trying to set traps too. So you have to be careful, okay? Well, I gotta go for now. Bye!